Hi, hi everyone. In this video, we are going to learn how to create organization charts using Google Sheets. This we will be creating only using cell values, no drawing, right? No drag drop arrows or boxes or anything like probably many of us have seen doing in the Google uh, slides or PowerPoints. No, it's just you put in uh, cell values and from that cell values, it will automatically put the uh, lines and boxes on its own. Right? It's automation. So for doing this kind of a chart, we would need to have some, the values put down like this. As you can see here as an example, on the left hand side, it will always be the parent header and on the right hand side, the child header, right? For example, let me get a little bit in the, like say there is maybe an organization which say the, the topmost position there will be CEO and MD and uh, there will be a three kinds of vice presidents reporting to it right so it's like i repeated the ceo and md in three different cells and then all the child values are different child values are corresponding to it right and so the graph turns out like this like see ceo ceo here vp here vphrm here and vp finance here right in the same fashion you can keep on going down and down down to the uh, lowest position in the organization by putting all the parent values on the left and their child values on the right and it should be only two column chart right uh, ensure that it doesn't become a, it doesn't become a three or four column chart it should only continuous two column if there are multiple sub values you multiple time repeat the names of the parent and put down the sub values right yeah so to create a card chart like this, um, let's go with the process. First, let's delete the output so that we can recreate it. Right? Uh, I'll zoom out a bit. Yeah, you have to select the entire area where the values are. Then go into insert tab. Inside the insert tab, you will see an option known as chart. Right? Click the chart option. It will uh, open up here. Here, let me put in a. In column chart, you go down and you will find an option like this, which looks like this. This is an organization chart wherein a name is given and two more is given. Right? So click that organization chart. Right? Now here, put this thing as tick. Use row two as headers because see, our row two is parent child. That's not a uh, relationship that we want in that. That is a header for our understanding. Right? So you put use row two as headers. After clicking that. There are these two options that you will right now see the chart is not showing the way we want, right? Because we need to do some configurations. See here it is showing parent and ID, right? For parent, we will have to choose parent values, right? And for ID, we have to choose the child values. So click here and click child values. See now the chart starts looking the way we want, right? Let me just uh, drag this up and make it bigger. Now it is done here, yeah, right? Now there are certain customizations you can do to this chart in the Google Sheets. Let me just zoom out here, yeah, right? For example, when we go here, we can change the colors of these boxes. Right? You click on this arrow, it says not color. You see, you can choose different. I can choose a green color, uh, red color, right? Uh, pink color, right? Uh, here. Or you can have a, a light orange color like this and so on. Let's say we go with this color a little bit darker. Right? Now you can change the size, how big or small the textual element in it are. See, when you put small, it becomes very small textual elements. When you make it large, it becomes really large. And medium is the default size. Right? And this is another thing, a selected node color. Let's say I'll uh, put it as a dark green color and select anything here. See, that thing then turns into green color, right? So this is the customization that is available to us. And this is so simple as creating the chart, putting a data range, putting the child value, parent value, and selecting the correct configuration. So that's all. We learn how to create the organization chart in Google Sheets. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.